Picks and Parlay family, it's me, Detroit Lenny, here to talk a little college football for you. Week three, Hilltoppers, Buckeyes. We're going to talk a little college football Saturday, September 16th. Bring with me to do that, Dre Richardson. Let's bring him in, talk a little college football, Dre, week three. Uh, here we are. Are, we, uh, are this matchup intriguing to you at all a little bit here? Ohio State has consistently dropped in the national rankings. Down to six now. Woohoo. Uh still two and oh. But they tr- they take on the Western Kentucky Hilltoppers, hosting them. Buckeyes minus 30, over unders at 65. Where are we going with this one? I'm going with the points with Ohio State. I know it's a lot of points, and uh they are underperforming in a sense of what they're supposed to be doing. Uh with you know, but they haven't had a competition yet, which is the scary part about this situation, is that WKU can throw the ball they will throw the ball they have ample talent at the wide receiver position the quarterback has already thrown to over six, six different receivers multiple times this season already in the last in the last two games so they're spreading the ball out they want to run they want to pass the ball they don't want to run the ball the problem is ohio state hasn't had the the chance to show their defense is really that good because they've played really bad team so far so this will be a great test for the dbs and for the dbs overall and the pass rush as well uh to put the pressure on this uh wku team who's not scared of the challenge um but the problem is with uh, wku they they are not good defensively okay they've already allowed they're averaging 23 points a game already allowed to the opponents like this is ridiculous and and if you're going to give it to uh Ohio State, they're going to blow you out. Simple as that. And if Ohio State can show an ounce of defense, I mean, not even, I mean, I'm talking about 70% defense in this game, they're going to run over them because they're also dualistically good. So if they can get a lead early, you know, Marvin Harrison Jr. Uh, gets, 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 gets them going and they run the ball the rest of the game, this could go under. But I'm taking them to dominate. In this game, because I, I do think they're going to showcase some defensive talent, because they have a lot of DBs that I do like in the drafts coming up uh, that should be able to show what they're capable of. So give me uh, Ohio State minus thirty. Okay, uh, I could see that uh, if that plays out like that, I could definitely see that. I I, I don't know this game. You know, I want to it, it, like Western Kentucky Kentucky's defense is good or offense is good. Their defense is bad, like you mentioned, and Ohio State's defense is good, but how good is it against that offense from Western Kentucky? We'll see. That's really going to be your matchup there. If you're looking for more from Trey Richardson on the premium plays, check out picksandparlays.net. Use the promo code NCAAF. Save you 20% off the entire site. Till then, he Dre Richardson saying Ohio State Buckeyes minus 30. I'm Detroit Lenny with picks and parlays. We'll see you guys on the next one. Go green, go right, outright. Good luck unless you're against me.